I'm Casey Forster here with Boilermaker All Access in Rick Schmieg. So Rick, obviously you're a huge guy and size and strength really isn't a problem for you. So can you actually tell me like how being that big helps you as an offensive lineman? Um, you know, you just got the, the strength uh, comes along with being big. Um, and then you have to you have to be athletic. Uh, you just can't be big. Um, but, de- but definitely the strength comes along with uh, being a big guy. And then what sorts of drills and stuff do you do to keep that strength? Uh, definitely in the weight room. The weight room <laughs> probably helps the most. Um, but, uh, yeah, like, yeah just, just the weight room and being out there doing the, doing the offensive line drills, those actually help your strength a lot. All right, and then what do you plan to do differently from the steak and bean scrimmage until for the, for the scrimmage that's upcoming this Saturday? Um, we just need to, you know, on offense we need to keep the ball and not turn, not turn the ball over as much. Um, I think that would that would be that would be a great start, um, and then just 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 um, blocking guys on protections, blocking guys right, but mainly keeping the ball, not turning it over. Okay, and then last question: um, What do you guys need to do this year as a team in order to push to be bowl eligible again? Um, well, like I said, one thing: keeping the ball, not you know, no enforced errors, turning the ball over, um, and as an offensive line, I would say um, definitely definitely working on pass blocking. Um, but, yeah, our, one of our main keys is, you know, keep, keeping control of the ball. All right. Thanks so much, Rick. I'm Casey Forster here with Boilermaker All Access. Hi, I'm Casey Forster here with Boilermaker All Access and Robert Macy. So, Robert, I understand that you you played in 12 games last year. You had 17 tackles. You were academic all Big Ten. So how do you plan to raise the bar from last season? Well, last season I was kind of injured, so I didn't really play in all 12. But, um I, you know, I'm kind of playing in different positions, and so uh, maybe I'll get some more interceptions. Maybe I'll, uh, you know, get some more pass breakups, something like that, um, in different categories. But then again, I still want to get all my sacks and uh, tackles for loss and things like that. So uh, I think I've, I think I've ways to improve. So. <laughs> and can you tell me a little bit about that transition from different positions? Um. Well, I'm still um, playing defensive end, okay. but I'm also going to be playing a little linebacker. Um, but it's it's not that foreign to me because I played a little bit in high school. Um, so it's 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 a lot like defensive end in some ways. So you know, when you're running the ball, you know, you can you're still hitting the same guys and tackling and you know playing with your hands and stuff. So, but then there's that added coverage to it. Okay, I gotcha. So um, how do you guys plan to defend your title from the stake and bead scrimmage to the spring game this Saturday? Well, I don't know if we're going to be doing offense to defense yet or if we're going to be splitting it up into two teams. So we'll have to see if we can get um, another uh, another round of the offense. <laughs> but um, I think we just keep doing what we're doing. You know, we're getting a lot of turnovers in practice and uh, that – that was what really helped us in the steak and bean scrimmage. And so if we keep doing that, we should be okay as long as we play sound. Okay. And then I understand your uncle also played football here as a defensive end back in the 70s. Can you yeah. talk a little bit about that legacy and, you know, how it feels to follow in his footsteps? Oh, man. Um, my uncle, he, uh, he walked on here. He also was an engineer, civil engineer. And so I'm an engineer too. So I'm kind of <laughs> kind of fit in the mold there. Um but you know he he'll be here for the spring game and um you know i like you know making him proud you know kind of he kind of lives through me in a little in some ways so um i'm happy i mean i didn't plan it that way but um it just happened that way it just happened that i happened you know i came here played defensive end he played defensive end same thing so gotcha. runs in the family <laughs> all right thanks so much robert i'm casey forster here with boilermaker all access